ಶ್ರೀಮದ್ ಶಂಕರ ಭಗವತ್ ಪಾದ ವಿರಚಿತ ಕಂಪೋಸ್ ಬೈ ಆದಿ ಶಂಕರ ವೇರ್ ಶಕ್ತಿ ಇಸ್ ದಿ ಆಬ್ಸಲ್ಯೂಟ್ ಡಿವೈನ್ ಸೌಂದರ್ಯ ಲಹರಿ ಅತಾಂತ್ರಿಕ್ ಮೋಡ್ ಆಫ್ ವರ್ಷಿಪ್ ಮಂತ್ರ ಶಾಸ್ತ್ರ ಆಂಡ್ ಅ ಡಿವೋಷನಲ್ ಪ್ರೇಯರ್ ಅ ಪೋಯಮ್ ಇನ್ ಶಿಖರಣಿ ಮೀಟರ್ ಟು ಮ್ಯಾಚ್ ಅ ಲಾಫ್ಟಿ ಥೀಮ್ ಲಿಟ್ರಲ್ ಮೀನಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಸಿಂಬಾಲಿಕ್ ಮೀನಿಂಗ್ಸ್ ಶ್ರೀ ವಿದ್ಯಾ ಕೋಡೆಡ್ ಇನ್ ದ ಮಂತ್ರ ಆಂಡ್ ಎಂಬಾಡಿಡ್ ವಿದ್ ಇನ್ ಅಸ್ ಇಟ್ ಇಸ್ ಆಲ್ ಹರ್ ಸೌಂದರ್ಯ ಲಹರಿ ಶಕ್ತ ಪ್ರಭವಿ ನೇವು ಕುಶಲ ಸ್ಪಂದಿ ಅತಸ್ವಾಧ್ಯ ಹರಿಹರ ವಿರಿಂಚಾದಿರಪಿ ಪ್ರಣಂತು ಸ್ತೋತು ವಾ ಕಥಮ ಕೃತ ಪುಣ್ಯ ಪ್ರಭವತಿ ವರ್ಸ್ ಒನ್ ಓನ್ಲಿ ವೆನ್ ವಿತ್ ಹರ್ ಕೆನ್ ಹೀ ಸ್ಟರ್ ಶಕ್ತಿ ಶೀಸ್ ಶಿವಸ್ ಪಾವರ್ ಈವನ್ ಶಿವ ಹೂಸ್ ಅ ಗಾಡ್ only prevails when paired with her then how can i mere i never did a good deed meritless i how dare i even bow to you even praise you you whom even the gods shiva vishnu brahma adore gems enclosed by groves of wish fulfilling trees in a garden of kadamba trees in a house made of chintamani gems resting upon a couch of prone shiva on pedestals of brahma vishnu rudra and ishvara you a blissful wave of consciousness only the fortunate worship who doesn't want to go to mani you bet to be one with chidananda lahari shloka 27 ಜಪೋ ಜಲ್ಪಶಿಲ್ಪ ಸಕಲಮಿ ಮುದ್ರಾ ವಿರಚನ ಗತಿ ಪ್ರದಕ್ಷಿಣ್ಯ ಕ್ರಮಣಮಶನಾ 
स्वाहुति विधि प्रणाम संवेश सुखमखिल आत्मापण दृशा सफलया पर तव भवतु यन्ने विलसितम् Let my chatter be the repetition of your name, Mantra Japa. Let my activity enact mystic signs, Mudra. Let walking be the steps of circumambulation, Pradakshina. Let all food be offerings to sacred fire, Ahuti. May laying down be a prostration to you, Pranama. Let all pleasures that give me comfort be like an offering of my own self, Atmarpana. May whatever I enjoy be yours, like recurring prayers. destroys dreadful decrepitude and death. Brahma, Indra and other gods who live in heaven do die. But in spite of eating vile poison, Shiva's unravaged by time. It's the magic power of your earrings. Earrings? These aren't just regular earrings, of course. Yes. They are cosmic, we know they are. As the Lalita Sahasranamam tells us, Tatanka Yuga Libhuta Tapanodu Pamandala. Shloka 35. Manastvam Vyomatvam Marudasi marudsarathi rasi Tvamapastvam bhoomihi Tvai parinatayam nahi param Tvameva svatmanam Parinamayitum vishvavapusham Chidanandakaram Shivayuvati bhavi Verse 35 You are mind, you are space, you are wind, you are fire whose charioteer is wind. You are water, you are earth. There is nothing beyond your full manifestation. 
you, yourself, expression of blissful consciousness. You assume the role of Shiva's damsel to become fully manifest through the physical universe. King of mountains, sages say, sages say the world ends and begins with the closing and opening of your eyes. But I suspect your eyes gave up blinking to save this whole world from annihilation. This world that was created by the opening of your eyes. Consort, please, please let the glance from your long eyes, lovely like just burst blue lotuses, also fall on poor me, so distant. As a moonbeam falls equally on both palace and jungle, then this devotee is blessed, and no harm to you either. Stilo Ganga Vartaha Stanamukula Roma Valilata Kalavalam Kundam Kusuma Sharati Jo Huta Buddha Rati Lila Garam Kima Pita Biladvaram Siddhi Girishanayanam Vijayati Verse 
verse 78. Oh mountain's daughter, your navel's something special. A still whirlpool in river Ganga. A water trench for the vine with two breast buds. Fire pit for the offering of Kama's prowess. House of pleasures for Rati, his consort. Entrance to a cave where Shiva's eyes achieve their yogic goals. knowledge drink the lack mixed water that washed your feet like the juice of chewed beetle from goddess Saraswati's lotus mouth that turns even born mutes into composers of poetry so much thirst in these verses yes Vidyarthi seeking Vidya thirst for knowledge from a moonstone to the moon, source of nectar, Argyam. Like trying to satiate the ocean with its own water, Tarpanam. Oh mother, these words of praise, Saundarya Lahari, are your words. It was a wonderful performance. I'd seen that the violinist had played uh, a few different ragas from the original, I think Sindhu Bhairavi that was playing when 
uh, you were singing. Uh, why did you choose those specific ragas? Was there any reason for it? All the three ragas that Ram played, one was Kalyani, the other one was Amrita Varshini, and the third one was Saraswati. All these are associated with Kritis, particularly famous Devi Kritis. And um, especially after the 98th shloka, where Goddess Saraswati is mentioned, he played the Saraswati Raga and ended with Madhyamavati, which is generally how all concerts end, the final ragam that's sung. Thank you for the question.